Hey there fellow collectors, today I got a new review for you because a lot of you requested it because I asked on Facebook group and let's begin. First of all, if you're underage, please stop watching. This video is intended for adult collectors only. Again, adult collectors only. So, if you're underage, get somebody to watch this with because it's not meant for you if you're underage. But anyways, so there's been a lot of conversation about these collection coming out and people were upset because the new Barbie look collection as you see here was already being sold on Amazon thanks to a particular person on the Am on Facebook group who kept posting the links thanks to you um you know who you are I'm not trying to put stuff out there but yeah uh because of you and everybody noticed that we were getting the links and we was able to order some of them so, a lot of you were able to order the Latina, the African-American one here, which we call AA. And she's a curvy one, obviously. And then we have the two Ken dolls. He is so cute. I love everything about him, even though he's cute too. But this, I've never seen this before. This is amazing. They need to keep doing this because this is awesome. And then you have your little petite. And then you have your tall version here, which we've seen that in the other collections pay lines and whatnot <clears throat> so this collection here uh, was actually on amazon really short time it sold out really really quick uh literally the price point to this is literally 19 dollars and 99 cents so this will probably be end up being well, I'm certainly, probably, I'm certain that it's going to be 100% um, mass produced. So, if you guys didn't get the opportunity to get this, um, or at least one or two of these, um, don't worry. You will get your hands on these. It's going to come. Don't worry. Uh, so, here's a little information in the bottom. If you guys want to read there, you want to pause it, read it, because I'm not reading this shit to you. But, um, and then you have this part here, and then you also have this part here as well. And this is the front. This is what it looks like. You guys seen pictures of the doll in the box. I showed it to you on Facebook. I ain't trying to get all up in that. So here's what it says on the side. Again, in the back from the distance. You guys can see here. And here it says model number two. And again, here's the front. And nothing on the back. It wasn't taped. So for, for those who are curious, these box don't come taped here um or on the top as well they don't come taped so it will be easy for you to take out the box just be kind of careful here if you don't want to rip the box it will rip i kind of used a uh one of those nail filers uh nail filer that um that are flat to kind of just kind of lift the lid a little bit and whatnot so that kind of helped but i might get another one and just keep it in the box only because i love this one very much so let's put that back here Let's face it like this. You guys can see the background there of this. So, here's another doll that came out a while back. A lot of people going crazy for this doll. It was the Zara Barbie. Um, people were upset because Mattel didn't uh, say anything about this doll. I'm not sure. But again, I mentioned on Facebook that it could have been a whole contract thing. Mattel does shit like that sometimes. But, uh, yeah. You know, I did a comparison to do a side by side. Clearly, this is like a, a younger version to the new curvy um, AA Barbie that we are getting or for some of them who have received it like me. Um, so, yeah. So, I'm going to put her back here again, where she belongs. And here I'm going to give you guys this beautiful curvy girl. She is so pretty. That face sculpt, it's so gorgeous. I could not pass on on this doll. She is beautiful. I'm so happy. It's been a while, and I don't even have a lot of AA dolls. Um, I think she would be my fourth, if I'm not mistaken. Um, that I just I just could not resist. Like she is gorgeous. I cannot stress that enough. Her hair, um, very, very soft. Oh, and also before I, I keep on, um, the packaging that held her inside was actually really easy, um, to take out. Um, this is the inside part. Uh, this is what it looked like. The stand was behind here. Um, her certificate 
came a little wrinkled, but here's the certificate before I forget that. So, you know, basic paper, nothing like collectible type of paper. It's just fucking paper. Um, but the it looks like this. Nothing was taped. This is not even taped. Um, I think they're kind of trying to make the whole packaging situation more simple for us to take them out so they won't like rip or anything like that. Um, I mean the packaging, I guess. Uh, but yeah, no, it was completely easy. Um, right here where she was held on her body parts here, just probably snip it. Or you could just fold these tags here and just push them and she'll come out. So good luck to that, to those people who want to do that shit because I, ain't, I wasn't doing that. I just cut her right out. But anyways, so here she is. Let me tell you, her hair, it's so soft. Oh, and I also did a, by, a side by side. <laughs> um... Clearly two different hairstyles. This doll has her hair net, so that's why her hair looks so tight in here and it looks the way that it does. Um, yeah, she's she's wearing a hair net. And this doll is not coming out the box. So for those who may have said some comments about the hair, this hair being better than this one, they're both soft. This one just is in a hair net. This one is not because clearly this one has more hair than this one. So let's put her back there. So the hair is really, really soft. She has a little bit of box hair back here, but it's really, really soft. Um, there isn't um, any product. Let me raise the camera a little bit higher. So you guys can see. Uh, it's really, really soft. I like it very much. I like how they did it. Look at this. Look, even if I push her face back like this, look at that face. <sighs> Gorgeous. Yes, honey. Look at the light. Look at that. Yes. Okay. All right. Let me not mess up her hair. Um, so this is the stand that it came with. Um, I'm not crazy about the stand. Let me tilt this down a little bit. Um, I'm not crazy about it. Um, the only reason why is because I don't feel like this is holding great. I don't think that her pose on this is holding awesome. And also this one thing, let me show you. So she obviously holds on like this, but look, watch, 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 watch. Watch, look. Look. See that? Look, it doesn't even grip. Look at that, look at that. Look at that. Look, look, look. Doesn't grip. So I don't know what's going on there. So this is the bottom of it. So basically a basic ass stand. Uh so here's the doll. Look how pretty she is. Look at that face. It's gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, I cannot get enough of this doll. She is beautiful. Let me just move this here a little bit more. Look at that. Look at that face. The eyes are so pretty. I'm going to zoom in so you guys can see. Look at this. Look at that. See how pretty? Look at that. No pixel. There's no pixel for those who um, were wondering. There is no pixelating in her eyes. Look at that. This face sculpt is so pretty. Okay, so let's now look at the rest of the body. So articulation here. Obviously on the shoulders, you guys can see her arms go up like this. Goes up like that. Doesn't go any further up than that. It's just just how much it goes up. She seems to have a pivot here. You guys can see there. Um, she has... Okay, obviously, she can do this. I don't know. I mean, now that I'm looking at this, I don't know if I like this situation here like i don't know how i feel great that she can do this that she can bend her arm like this and she could probably do that little um tick tock thing that people go you know ah, when you when you fold hard to the back like you can touch your nails to your shoulders but um yeah i don't know how i feel about this joint thing they probably need to kind of like work on that because this shit is looking kind of weird um so yeah so it looks like this Clearly, she has movement in her hand. Her hand actually feels really, really soft. It's really, really soft. Look at that. Look. See? Soft. Um, 
Okay, so this is the part where a lot of people were telling me that they felt like she had a broken piece off. But if I do this, you can't see it. I'm thinking it's because of the joint. Let me, let's get this to focus. You see that right there? She appears to have like a little crack there, but I mean, do you see what's happening too? That's just from the, the marking here. That's from the, the straps that was holding her from the box. So, and the camera is picking up a lot. Um, in person, not so much, even though I can see the shine and I can see a little bit with, you know, with the naked eye. Obviously, I can see it, but I can see it, but it's not showing that much. But yeah, it appeared that she may have had or has a crack, but you can't really get and zoom in this to this really good much. You guys can see. You guys can see there better. So, you guys can see that. So, you see that how the way it looks there. So, I don't know why that's like that. But you cannot really notice this. Okay, she has like a little mark here. Again, it's not really noticeable. So, so, but if I go like this, you can't really see anything. I think it's only because of the joints. You see how that is? Yeah, so, then she has this joint here like that. Let me see something. So, okay, so I can able to bend like this. Okay. And then she does turn. Let me zoom this out again so you guys can see. She does zoom. I mean, she does move here. Before it moves like that. Okay. So that's that on this. Again, she moves here. Zoom out, zoom out, zoom out. She moves here. Uh, no twist. There's, yeah, there's no twisting here. <clears throat> no twist. I'm sorry, I have a cold, so bear with me here. Uh, she does have... Oh, the joints are a little tight there. Um, bend on the knee. On the knee. On one of the knees. Well, basically both knees. Uh, she moves like that. Let's do this one. Like this. Yes. Well, here you go. Like this. Okay. Let's kick her out like this. Fix with the joints are a little tight. Um, and these are her shoes. You guys can see here. Here are the shoes. Super cute. Very basic. Uh, this is the back part. Uh, I wonder what her feet look like. Okay, so these are. This is her foot. You guys can see there. Oh shit! She doesn't have. Look at that. Where her toes go? She don't got no toes. I guess this is what $20 gets you. You get a pretty face, but you get no toes. I mean, you see something there happening, but you don't get it. And why her feet is so shiny? <laughs> um, yeah, so this is happening. <laughs> that is so funny. All right, so here's the shoes. Um, yeah, they're kind of cute. They're very basic, you know, basic. All right, let's pop that in there. That was, f oh my God, that's funny. Um, yeah, so let me zoom out again. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Oop, there, you guys can see the trip out there. Okay, so, yeah, so this is what you're going to get in the back. Let's look at the back. <laughs> oh my God, the feet thing was, it's funny. Um, okay, so... Let's see, what's this? Velcro. She sells Velcro. Oh, she has a little gold stamp. You have, okay, let me just... It's gold. Look at that. Let me put this. You guys can see the information there. And she has a little tag here. You guys can see there, a little tag. Um, Barbie signature tag. Um, this is actually, is this, how is this placed here? Huh. Okay. Let me just see this. Look at this. It's held with double-sided tape. Why on the earth would they do that? That is stupid. Maybe just to keep this down, I get it. But damn, you couldn't use the rubber band or something. Oh my God. Okay, let me just, comes right off. Good thing it comes right off. 
yeah that I didn't like that part okay so it looks like that I wonder if I could just untie this so I can really I don't want to untie it because I don't want to struggle trying to put this top part again so zoom out I don't want to struggle with that I'm not, I'm not gonna do that okay little velcro I mean I don't mind that she has velcro because she is a $20 Barbie you know it's not like she's a plain line Barbie. She's definitely something meant for adults. Because how the way she looks and style. I mean, if you want to buy this for your child, by all means do it. Um, yeah, so... I don't know how I feel about this. This joint here. They should really learn how to... Okay, so she actually kicks like this. This is the far that she kicks. She can't not do the split. Obviously her legs go forward. Let me put this like that. She looks like kicking. It goes forward. It goes back. She could do the split like this. Hey. Um. Yeah. She's so fucking pretty. I can't for her face. Like I'm not even mad that I spent twenty dollars on her. Like she's so cute. Um. Yeah. Let me let me let me zoom in into this face again because her face is so pretty. Oh. Uh. She does not have. Well, obviously, she don't have feet. I mean, toes. Um, so her nails are not painted. I don't know if you guys noticed that or not, but her nails are not painted. Um, it would have been cute if they painted her... Um, her nails, but I guess they must have figured she ain't got toes. Why are we going to paint her nails? But look at this face. Look how gorgeous that face is. Beautiful. Look at that. Beautiful. Those lips, like, oof, honey. They look like mine when I get them done. <laughs> um, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys what she looks like, what the articulation was. Again, don't forget she does this. Hey. Um, this stand, on the other hand, okay, this stand is shit. I'll tell you that freaking much. But maybe I can put her, like, on a chair or something, like one of those Barbie chairs that I have. Um... Okay, so I'm gonna actually see how can I let me see can I pose her? Let's see, like they have her on the box. Let me see. The moment of truth, right? Let's see. So they have her. Ooh, when I do this, her joint here feels no. If it, this part right here actually feels a little loose, um, not too loose, but it feels a little too loose for my taste. Okay, so here we go. Like this. Like th she's like this. Right? And then she has this arm straight. I'm assuming it's like this. But. Yeah. Oh, and her shoes. Um, Her shoes are not made of hard plastic. It's really soft. Like, really, really soft. So, I just think it's ever I forgot that. Um, just mention, mention that, actually. So, yeah. This is her. Let me lower this camera down a little bit so you guys can get more of a better view like this. Yeah. So here she is being super cute. I do really like this doll. Okay, now I see why they put the double-sided tape thing in here because this thing is coming up. Maybe you could just probably like pin it to the back here. You could probably just tuck it in there um but this is what she looks like oh my god her hair is so poofy and so soft i love it um yeah you guys totally can see um and i think you can see comparison so this is basically like little sister meets big sister Hi, little sister have brown hair. Big sister have more darker brown hair. Um, little sister's wearing a tube top. Um, and some biker short from biker pants, shorts, whatever you want to call that. And the sister's wearing like a halter top type of jumpsuit. Uh, but yeah, I just, you know, wanted to share. And I think that is important that I share this with you guys. Because a lot of you guys are a little pissed off because you guys... Ordered it and apparently some of them got cancelled or whatever the case may be. But I was actually extremely lucky that I got her. I'm extremely happy that I have her. Now I need to look for a spot for this one right here. Um, 
I originally was not going to take out the box, but I'm going to just end up ordering another one, you know, just to keep in box because somebody noticed that crack or something here on her wrist here, but I don't think it's just a crack. I think it's just the hand. Let me look at that again one more time. Yeah, it's just the joint. It's just like that because if I do this, you guys can't see that it's not even there anymore but yep this is what you this is what twenty dollars is gonna get you guys um yeah this is what twenty dollars is gonna get you guys uh i think I, let me tell you overall she's a beautiful doll i love her face she's amazing i hope that they use this face sculpt for a co actual collector's doll they need to because this I want more of this. This is gorgeous. Like, it's beautiful. Like, I cannot get enough of her face. Like, I just love looking at her. Um, yeah. You guys, please be patient. They are coming way into the end of the month. Hopefully, Mattel will release it a week before July. Or maybe it's supposed to be released in July. So... There's a lot of information. Mattel finally posted it up on their website. If you are a Barbie member, um, Barbie Signature member, and you could look at the forms, they already did the whole thing there, but they haven't put any release dates. But just be patient. You guys will get your dolls. Um, I just seem to be very lucky and fortunate that, um, that I got this doll before um, a lot of other people did, or some people just got it. They just haven't posted anything about it i mean even though that's seen pictures on on instagram as well and on facebook of the other dolls that people already received them especially the blonde hair can but i really really wanted to share um again thank you for watching uh if i will post pictures on facebook now that i took out the box even more pictures so just be on the lookout for that thank you again for watching I hope I wasn't rambling. I hope that what I told you guys was helpful. But thank you again for watching. I really appreciate it. And I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the week and holiday. Um, well, I think the holiday just passed, right? Well, that was yesterday. The Monday, actually. Sorry about that. But yeah, enjoy your weekend. It's coming up. Um, Gay Pride Month. Yay. So thank you.